Well, hello everyone. You hear here right here is a, a coloring activity right here that I would hit and do right here with uh, you know some pen sketches right here of like you know, for wedding anniversary. Talk about for twelve years and knowing about. I'm like, yeah, that if it was what you call you know, my mom and you'll be married you know, to her husband as well. And then that uh, you have right here is like a kind of like say like a like a story if we want to call it like say like a your know, story based on like if for whenever couples you know, whenever they meet especially for. Uh, you know, from uh, what you call, you know, for love it is, and and uh, if anybody were weren't, or the, yeah, that that uh, you know, if, uh, if anything, I could maybe write that it's like on here, but uh, or it's like include that, but uh, on, on the other page, but you know, talk about for love though, but uh, but you see right here is that um, I would include this right here is like if this was right here was example for like which says you know for couples, you know, couples whenever they met, whenever they were kids. Especially, and um, think about it's like for that that you know, these right here would be pen sketches that, that I would have seen you know, that I found you know that I would have and sketch right here. This right here would be example right here of a boy and a girl right here. Like a boy and a girl basically means as to where that from how they met, and uh, I guess I can go ahead and include that right there. It's like for how uh, you know how it you know how people meet and. Um, you have right there, it's like for me, I like it for how they meet, especially. And uh, anybody that may weren't were that, yeah, that uh, typical to where if you're going to be meeting somebody or that if you're going to be uh, reuniting with somebody, uh, maybe within a, you know, a certain time or so that you know, you may have met this person before and then uh, thinking necessarily to where, hey, that, uh, that you know, this person, you know, yeah, you know this person right here. But uh, on your hand that you see right here is that... Uh, then this right here will be some drawings I would, you know, a drawing right here of like say man and woman right here and uh, and uh, talk about besides before like any type of weddings though uh, but that you know they may know each other maybe since high school or maybe since the job and uh, you're like Warren toward it yeah that you know for like which they knowing about for you know, what love is especially. And if anybody were weren't, were to, yeah, that, uh, you know, if anybody were asked, it's like, you know, anybody, it's like, do you even know what love is? Like, an, yeah, that means together. <laughs> and, uh, you do see, do some people say that, or do some people think about it as to where that love basically means, you know, support for one another. Love basically means as to where that, you know, you share each other, you share with each other's belongings or anything like that. Or does love basically mean to where that, uh, you know, yeah, that uh, love basically means something such as is to where that, that, you know, yeah, about uh, for like, uh, there's something about that, that four letter word to where it's like knowing about for low and then V, it's like so far as love. And um, so I know that, uh, that we, we may think about this every so often as to where, that you know, love can maybe mean a number of meanings, but one of those will be as to where does that mean together, or does it mean as to where that you know, yeah, the type of a uh, emotional feeling to where that yeah, that uh, you know, it basically means as to where that uh, that there there more likely is a difference between that love and hate, but then on your hand that you're like weren't to where that uh, we may say some things such as we hate this, we hate that. But then on your hand too, if we look at this like maybe like a little bit of the opposite as well. But on your hand that you see right here is talk about for love right here. And uh, this right here would you know, this right here would be a pen sketch right here on a notebook right here. So if anybody were warned to where, yeah, while I was taking down notes and I was drawing this and uh, anybody that may warrant to where yeah, do some work right here on Photoshop. But uh, you have right there is that right there, knowing about for how couples meet, and I know that um, you're like Warren to where that yeah that it's kind of like what you call a really interesting uh, situation, a real interesting story about us to where that you know for how uh, people reunite with each other, and it could maybe be at the restaurant or maybe at the you know at the bowling alley or maybe at the theaters or anything like that at the carnival, so. People that you may have met those couple of years ago and how they reunite, especially. And then you see right here is like for talk about for weddings, though. And this right here would be example right here of my mom. And uh, they, she would be dressed in like say a wedding dress right here, as well as like the person that she's planning to marry also. 
And uh, I kind of drew him as like, no one of anybody say that, yeah, that uh, the way I'd sketch this. And I know that like with any type of a wedding gown, you know, that they would be wearing also, you know, it may not match all from uh, what, the, you know, from the actual wedding. You know, of course, that was over 10 years ago. But uh, this right here would be an example right here of me right here. And, um, you know, while I'll be walking and knowing about the other, uh, the mom would tell the son as to where to, yeah, the, you know, please walk with me and um, and then I can also if anybody wanted to where the eye like uh, maybe draw like a little if I want to go ahead and maybe draw a little shadow or something like that you maybe on the ground draw like a little shadow if they were like saying be like a little shadow right here but knowing about that uh, yeah celebrating the the, the 12th uh, you know, anniversary of like say knowing about about the couples especially and uh, and I know with most weddings it's that uh, Whenever, you know, the first, uh, I remember that wedding that I was at, it was like the first one I've been to in a very long time, and uh, I think if I can remember right that the last wedding I was at, that I can remember, if I can remember right that uh, I was even late for this one, if I can remember right, yeah, I was, I was about half an hour late getting to this one, which, knowing about getting a, you know, like anybody like warrant or yeah, if you and if you were late a little bit late to it, but knowing about if anybody asked like yeah, or you were there at the wedding, but then on your hand that, that you know you were also what you call like you know, besides if you're late, but that you know you were also in the, the wedding as well. It's like you were the person what you call you know, you know, you know, leading your your mom you know, to the person that you plan on marrying you know, to the groom, but uh, on your hand at the from basically from what we remember as well and 12 years seems like a, a long time of course and um, why is it that for that reason at 12 years you know, 12 years kind of reminds me of what you call you know by midnight and uh, we may weren't or that by midnight or some sort of uh, a night like maybe by midnight or like don't about for anything special to look forward to especially but knowing about for 12 years so I know like with some people that they may want to celebrate an anniversary based on what you call it's like a yeah for how long we've been dating for and as well as you know for how long that we've shared each other's love for or anything like that. And uh, so some couples that may think as to where yeah 12 years and knowing about and like and you don't know what it's like. But, but other than that like I talk about right here is that uh, with the uh, this uh, you know working with uh, like the uh, with, with these these sketches right here is that you have right here is like for happy anniversary and uh, with the wedding so and uh, the way I think about though is like uh, looking at these uh, you know, drawings right here and I can uh, maybe you know, so I can change the color up uh, just a little bit to go ahead and add like a uh, you know, if I want to work with like a little bit of uh, green go to work a little green right here and then a uh, Put like a little, you know, I'm like, yeah, especially for like the flowers. I don't know if the, if my mom were to be holding any kind of flowers or some kind, you know, at the wedding. But if I could remember, she, I don't know if she was holding anything in particular. But, but this is how, uh, if we can see this right here about how uh, that, that picture show right here is to where it, it was like what you call, I would have a, my uh, left arm wrap around my, my mom's right arm and then be able to lead her, you know, to the, to the person she was planning on marrying and then they would uh, have it, you'll be playing music and and that uh, like during the ceremony especially and like say for the sermon though and I can remember that a lot of things that were mentioned uh, you quite a few things during the the 20 minutes of, uh, of the wedding though is to where that the, the, the sermon was mentioning about about how many years at the like uh, for the story about that that knowing it for that uh, whenever they you know they marry and uh, that uh, for the, basically the, the nine years from whenever they were looking out for one another and knowing about you know for that uh, that you know for how they met and as well as for how they share each other's love and all that you know, all that other stuff about about the story and uh, one thing I do remember mentioning is about like most of the time with most weddings is to her that they say for some reason that y'all think these couples should not be married should speak now at the concert at the convention and, and, and uh, and basically, it was like, yeah, that uh, that there is no problem, sir. Like, and then it's like, and you all accept these people being married? We do. But uh, so that basically, that if anybody has been in the other weddings, and basically, if it's going to be anything related to like um anything about you know for you know gatherings, like well as 
no one's like you know for like you know between these like you know kiss the bride as well as no one said that uh, for like, anything else that goes on in a wedding especially and that uh, of course quite a bit of that was 12 uh, already coming up on 12 years uh, you know it's like you know, uh, September so I know with most couples that they're like weren't to where that you'll go to any weddings or some sort and you're like weren't to where that yeah that uh, that uh, you may think that you know maybe a few things that may still be the same after 12 years and quite a few things have changed especially but um, we may think necessarily to where the yeah that whenever couples do meet right here you have right here is is the bride is like with groom as well as you know, the per the person that uh, it's like that the man that the you know the, the bride is planning on marrying especially and you see right here is it uh, with like the, you know, the gentleman right here and um uh, I'm sure that you know not all you know married couples are like that they're gonna have a a whole lot of money you know to really to work with especially and as well as you know for the things that they do have especially so let's just say that uh, with like uh, you know like one or two whenever couples get married that they uh, one of them could be have a could be working or that one of them could have like say that yeah that you know the house or maybe if it's a car or anything like that and uh, thinking that um that you know for all from what more likely what the bride has especially but maybe by one story yeah like I draw like a little shadow right here represents like you know, for the bride right here but you see right here is a, a photoshop work right here and uh, and I'm like with anybody that, that if they're gonna be you know getting married and or if they like say that, that if they're gonna be uh, celebrating their anniversaries especially anniversaries basically is like to where that 12 years, especially 12 years of like an anniversary, especially. So you're like one to where that, uh, you know, you we may have had, we may not have had a whole lot whenever we were young and think about this tour, whenever the, the bride and then the groom are like, you know, the bride and then the, you know, you know two couples, whenever they meet, that uh, they may not have a whole lot of money either and they may not have a whole lot of stuff. So whenever we look at this right here, this sketch right here, and thinking necessarily to her that you know yeah that uh, you know about how many times did it take you for you to propose <laughs> and you're like well, to her, well you know actually uh, like knowing about you know somebody may say you shared a story about you know, about the cook you know the guy you know that you know, he was a cook at the restaurant and then that's just how we proposed and you're like well, to her about how many times you know, has that uh, the person has the that the boyfriend you're trying to propose and how many times like knowing about waiting for the, the girlfriend to say something especially so knowing about say for any amount of times like you're know, for proposing and um and I know that if anybody were weren't to where the time the story that goes by is to where that uh, for whenever a guy that becomes what you call if we want to call it puppy love especially whenever a young boy that becomes serious about a girl and uh, you know they may meet maybe on a job maybe in the cafeteria maybe on the playground at the park or anywhere and they're like weren't to where that yeah that from how they meet that, that they walk up to them and they like weren't to where they're not going to say anything such as to where <laughs> that excuse me miss yeah I'm in love with you uh, you know I'm interested in you they're going to likely say to where hello uh, miss yeah um you may remember me yeah from some point uh and I I just want to know if you want to or if you want to do this or or if you want to hang out at, at two o'clock or if like so there may be a number of things that uh, yeah, it's like yeah that you know if we if we know it's like based on not really something that you would do we would want to see that we would see in those one of those movies or some sort but uh, for basically that um, that you're trying to ask the woman or that the woman may want to try to ask the guy something. But then you're like warned to where this is what you want to begin the conversation by, or if you want to start another way, or if you want to start at the proper way. So I know that uh, there's other what you call means of like how it led to the story, especially. But I would the way I do this right here, this right here will be right here related to like me. So if anybody were warned to where the yeah that uh, if you may meet somebody knowing about or like really that you know, you may have your degree in digital design, and then uh, this person right here, this this woman that you're interested in, that you're know, the per you know, the woman who uh, who does take interest in, in me and necessarily that she may have her degree in what you call and maybe animation. Or if it's going to be what you call English literature or anything like that, 
and uh, you know, any type of degree like maybe related to like designing. So if anybody weren't or that yeah, that uh, the way that how couples meet each other, if they're going to be young ages or so, and and sometimes that they may say that you know the younger couples that may say is to her that the guys are afraid you know to say anything to the woman you know just because that they are afraid that they won't like them you know, they'll they'll say no if they try to propose to them as as well as it knowing about you know for anything else like talk about say for wedding rings and as well as for engagement or anything like that so I know that um, 12 years I guess seems like a long time really to put all this together really just to realize about really how you all meet and knowing about the basic story but really that uh, you know for 12 years and knowing about for how how long that this came along to where that uh, with you know these couples it's like they've been together for quite you know quite a long time and you're only thinking about is to where really does it require a lot of money just to be able to keep the relationship together before I talk about together and um, and and I know that uh, anybody that may weren't to where that yeah that that were really would the where the president say anything like this right here to where that yeah that anything about what you call represents together <laughs> but on, on your hand that that, that you have right here is that with that this uh, talk about us like you know, for together though and uh, and uh, see here to um, go ahead right there okay making sure that uh, yeah you use right here as a type tool but anyway uh, but you got right there it's like for together so I know that anybody probably say I'm like well what about the group I'm like what about I'm like yeah but and as of right now I'm just using this this drawing right this sketch right here with the pen like a uh, with these two couples, and, and I know that I do this mainly, and anybody that may want to where a lot of things that I'm talking about may not match all with, with what's going on right here. But, uh, you know, on your hand, it seems like that a lot of what I'm talking about really contains a lot of information from what has been happening for the next, for the past 12 years, based on from my education, as well as maybe the, the woman of my dreams, and compared to the one, you know, to the guy of my mom's dreams or anybody else, and uh, you're like warrant tour whenever they celebrate their anniversaries, especially. But on your hand, that uh, you see right here is my Photoshop work right here, and it really, it's 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 really surprising. I think it's really surprising about how couples meet up again. That that you know, yeah, if it's going to be on a job, or if it's going to be what you call anything about what you call if anybody like warrant tour traffic stop, or maybe if it's anything about the carnivals. Or the fairs or the festivals and but um on your hand that um that really that whenever I was drawing this I was also thinking about as to where at this like this right here will be a, a, a girl and then right here with a boy right here between a, a man and a woman and uh you have right here is the girl would have her arm wrapped around the shoulder of the of the guy and uh think as to where the oh, you know, the amount of support that they give you one another and um and I know that, uh, like with anybody, that if you were to be, uh, what you call, you'd be marrying somebody who you, you know, they known you since class, and uh, thinking about it as to where a lot of people who have gone through their struggles, especially, a lot of those struggles could be as to where that your GPA score wasn't so great, or you weren't making that much money from your job, or you, know, you had problems whenever you were young. So I know whenever couples meet that they may say is to her, I didn't think that you liked me just because I had problems, you know, from my junior year. You know, I had problems when in the seventh grade, in the fifth grade that I have issues. Uh, you know, kids, you know, they, they picked on me and uh, as well as, you know, any other you know situation like that. And I know with me, though, and I can tell anybody here that, yeah, that, uh, that you know, yeah, that, um, I'm not a real big eater either, so if anybody weren't to where that if anything I only eat like one meal a day or so and if anybody weren't to work really that you know you gotta eat, you know, just to be able to get make you strong and as well as get you strength and, and knowing about you know for what the doctor said especially. So we're like weren't to where that any source of education that a man and woman more likely have, like maybe with me though as a designer and putting all this these you know, all these artworks are so together, and just for you know, for anything that I may find out, especially anything that I may find, and knowing about for whenever we graduate. So I know that um, that whenever couples do meet, they may may they may have known each other at the restaurant or maybe in high school for about maybe a year and a half, maybe two years until it's like you know yeah, it takes about maybe five years for them to reconnect. 
and then uh, knowing about his tour that really that uh, if anybody warrants his tour that uh, what do you kind of call that what you call that story of companionship to her after about five years and thinking about his tour that you actually go somewhere maybe if it's at a meeting you meet the the guy or woman of your dreams at the meeting and think about his tour that yeah you know, you're getting trained, you know, you're you're in town to be get trained on something that you know important, such as you know, how to use that, you know, how to use the systems that they're telling you about. If it's anything maybe related to social security or anything like that, that uh, you're like Warren to her, that uh, it's like really some people that may say is to where it's about being at the right place at the right time, really just what you know is to where this person this person who knows you and who's what you call in love with you from all with all that you do especially. So whenever we think about this and think about the story right here for 12 years, if anybody warns us to her, why does it take 12 years for anything special to happen and so knowing about how to celebrate, especially on special occasions. But uh, the way I do this, you know, like I mentioned before, was talk about right here is to where these two couples right here that, uh, you know, they may ask me the questions to her, then what were you all, what were you upset about? It's like, you know, that they may ask me a question that was something that was related to maybe a job or maybe an interview or maybe if it was something in class and think about us to her that, yeah, that, that you know, you're, you didn't do very good on a test. Well, you know, you, you try to, you try to surprise everybody. You try to show the best uh, work for everybody, including that girlfriend that you knew uh, back whenever you were in school and think about, you know, after five years later and then that, that they, you know, ask you, it's like, well, what were you, what were you mad about, cutie? Like, well, you want to know what I was mad about? Well, really, that, uh, you know, I want to make, I want to try to handle anything with no problem at all. And it seems like it was just too frustrating because I didn't think that you would like me if I would have failed the test or if I didn't do so great on this or that. And so it seems like that a lot of times that the ladies are like, like, shh, 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 it's okay. Like, an, you know, don't, don't worry about it. Like, so, so that's just a thing, though, is to where that, um, like with anybody, maybe like the president or anybody that your counselors that they're like Warren to where, you know, love should not have any, you know, it's like, you know, love should not have to break up, you know, it's like this, this relationship. And I, and I know that, uh, like with anybody that if it's going to be between that marriage and engagement or if it's going to be anything about what you call teamwork you know, together, that uh, the way I think about those is to where that if anybody warns is to where that, that, you know, how are you going to be, I mean, when do you think that you're going to be meeting your special love one of these days and, you know, how do these people meet especially? So there's there are more likely there's going to be many of exclamations and many stories that we may hear about. But one of those main stores would be is to her that no one abides to her that you know, for how far somebody's going to be willing to come along to her that they're willing to uh, step up and tell you know, the man or the woman the truth about what they think about everything. I was like knowing about anybody that may warrant to her that yeah, that you want to step up and tell the lady the truth about your feelings about her. And it's like, you know what, I may not be the smartest guy in the world, but I really, I really enjoy what you do and then on your hand that I've come all this way you know, it took me three years to get all this together to buy you a ring and as well as to knowing about that I I am interested in you and as well as for what you do and knowing about that I think we can work out our problems together as long as we can work together and knowing about how to be able to solve our own problems together as well and all this is about it's not just about me it's not just about you it's about us so just think about us to where that knowing about if anybody warns to her that anything about what it calls like a, for anything like an, like an, if it's going to be like a, a bunch of flowers or knowing about like an, you know, knowing about it's like an, and I you know I'd like to show me love and I want to marry you but on your hand that that um, anything about honeymoons especially but um, but while I was working this picture right here and I was also thinking about if anybody warns is to her that yeah working a picture right here really about how much love, I'm like, you know, really, I'm like, is the guy going to confess about how much that he loves the woman? You know, how much do they need to show about, you know, love between one another? So you have right here is this writing right here. If anybody were warrant to her, can you hear and read the person's voice just by looking at the writing? You know, we the graduates, you know, when we graduate, work associate for the better, for the students, and knowing if our best for the future. 
And um, whenever we think about this also is to where that some gentlemen and some ladies that may say is to where that really that you know how do uh, the men you know, propose to the ladies especially if they have the ring but then knowing about really that uh, is it going to be at dinner or is it going to be at the gathering or a greeting card or just knowing about this to her that yeah that uh, you know I want to give you something and it's something special but um, so that's just the thing about me and I know like with anybody that uh, whenever they propose they may have their stories especially but knowing about the couple that I know that's like been married for 12 years and think about with me though is to her that how far my artwork has come along to her explaining about these stories and uh, this right here is basically uh, an example right here. It's not really a true story to where that, you know, this is how the boy and the, and the man, you know, the, the lady, the girl and then the boy, you know, this is how they met and then whenever they were young. But but on your hand too, I can tell anybody here that back whenever I was young that I did want to kind of surprise a lot of people about this tour to tell a story like this using my freehand work and then that knowing about what my talents and my skills and knowing about what love can buy me especially and um and really that sometimes it go by the story tour that uh, you know whenever a man and woman whenever they do meet and think about this tour that you know they may not want to tell them the story just because maybe they failed or maybe they didn't do so well on a test you know, they didn't think that they would be able to cook very well for him, and so I know, like with the with the you know the wife may have met the guy, you may you know, at the cook, you know, maybe uh, if he was a cook or so, or working at the restaurant, and then the, the lady could have been what you call a counselor or somebody you're know, working, or maybe if they were being you know, just around town or so, and think about you know how couples meet, especially. And uh, you're like warning to her that really, is it, why is it that some gifts were not delivered right away, huh? It takes 12 years or maybe or so just for maybe a package to be delivered or just for a message message to be to be mentioned as well. But um, on your hand too, it kind of surprises me to where how far I come along to her and knowing about that, uh, you know, uh, the love, what I can talk about especially is to her that any girl's that I may meet, you know, especially on those social media sites, and knowing about really about that, you know, if you were to try to propose, and that you're like warned to her that really that you know any type of a, uh, you know any type of romantic uh, messages that they may send, you know, especially to her that I keep thinking of is to her that you know how do we know for when we're ready for this love and companionship so if anybody warns us to her that yeah the boy was on the video game and then the girl was on the video game and this is how they connected but on your hand too with my story from what I'm trying to you know, figure out here is knowing about is to her how my artwork is going to show that type of love and that seems so impossible how does my artwork show any kind of love really but some that may say is to her that uh, with your artwork that basically means is to her that yeah the type of English language is to her is to her you know between uh, the verbs and then pronouns is to her a man and woman they show each other companionships as well as together and almost like for the love of the hearts so if anybody were wanting to her yeah it's like you draw hearts right here and so you got the green selected but uh, anyway uh, yeah Go ahead and draw an example right here of a heart right here. So this was right here was like a, you know, a, a love, a you know, romantic story right here of a man and woman right here. Basically talk about, you know, for each other, sharing each other's love especially. And uh, you're like, weren't to her that, you know, really, you know, does artwork really uh, have anything to do with love necessarily? But uh, the way I think about it, though, is like, really, that you know anything that maybe can tell the story very well, anything that maybe they can you know that can be done by the person. What you call? Yeah, you can't do it by yourself. So you know this person, this person who really cares a lot about you, that maybe be willing to what you call you know, do you know some of the work, especially with you and knowing about that. That you know for anybody that may say is to worry about love and romantic relationships, really is to worry about sharing a. You know, another part of, of what you call you is a part of them as like the person also is to her. You're like warm to her that, uh, yeah, that, uh, you know, my artwork pretty much became a part of me for anything that I did, I may do in my career. So it's like, you know, the woman that may say is to her, yeah, well, 
something else that's a part of me too. I know about anything about you. You don't. You may not have a whole lot of money, but then on your hand too, there's something a lot that I do see. You you have a lot of what you call great creativity as well as for great concern as well. I may not know absolutely no have no idea anything too much about maybe your growing up childhood, especially about the reason why you do this, the reason why you do that, but I consider you is what you call a very special person. So the way I think about though is like talk about say for love and romance. So you're like warrant to worry if anybody warrant to worry about this whole purpose about love right here. During this time that you know of course that was before I was even in college. So you're like, Warren, we have right here is the, the mom and it's like the man you know, of her dreams. And talk about right here is like, a, you know, if anybody weren't to her, yeah, you walk up to a woman and what are you going to say to them? The one that you're that you're in love with. And you're like, Warren, to her, really, I am a very special person. So I have a very interest in you. And then they may say something like, well, that's good to hear. But, you know, about this puppy love, where did it come from? So that's why that may be one of the reasons why that you know maybe not all guys want to speak up about their feelings about a woman. They may have met them maybe in band class or so and think about as to where how do couples propose, especially. But uh, I heard that talk about for weddings, it's like for anniversaries for twelve years, happy anniversary. You like to know about the couples, you know, that you've know, been together for quite a long time and thanks for listening to the story and have a great day.